Hi everyone, welcome to Patty's Polish Corner and today is my 12 days of Christmas nail art day three and I hope you like this one. I will show you a picture of it and then I'll show you how I created it. So let's get started. First, I'll be um, applying my Wave Gel Base Gel. And today I'll also be using the Wave Gel Shiny No Clean Top Coat. I'll be using Wave Gel's Holiday Cheer, which is a great dupe for, I think it's called Ruby Slippers by um, China Glaze. So it's called Ruby Slippers. And I'll also be using Wave Gel's Snow Ice. I have two coats of Snow Ice and Holiday Cheer on my nails right now. And I'll be using um, Kira Sky's Iceberg just to add a little bit of a sparkle, kind of like an iridescent sparkle kind of like a hollow, like a light hollow sparkle actually. I'm not sure the camera is picking up the rainbow shifts and the polish. So I'll just be applying a little bit of this over my white and then I'm going to put the shiny no clean top coat on just to smooth it out so the stamping isn't bumpy. I'll be using my MoU London Stamper and Scraper. And I'll be using this Uber Chic Stamping Plate, um, which is, it's Christmas 02. I think they renamed it though. I think it's called Holly Jolly now. I don't really know. But I'm going to be using these ornaments right here. One of these ornaments. And it's a layered ornament. I really don't know what this is for. Oh, I know what that's for in case you want your ornaments to hang down. But we don't need that bar. We just need the circle and one of the ornament prints. For the background of the ornament, I'm going to use Twinkle Tees Stamping Polish. I think it was called the Frost Collection. And this is Swerve, which is a beautiful, looks like a metallic -y red, completely gorgeous. And I'll be using Color Clubs um, on the rocks. And this, this stamp's really good, and I love the color. So it's just a, a nice silver. Okay, so first we're going to pick up the ornament. And the pickup is really good. And I'm just going to place the ornament right here. Okay. okay, now we'll be picking up the second part of our ornament. So that was a very nice pickup. And now I'm going to put it right over here. There we go. Now I'm going to use um, one of my new Lena plates. Actually, I just got it in the mail. And um, this is Winter 02. It's part of their Four Seasons collection. And I really, really love it. I'm going to use these um, cute little, um, gosh, pine, <laughs> pine needle leaves here. And for this, I'm going to use my Hit the Bottle, and it is See What I Green. 
Okay, so for this image, I had to switch stampers because um, it's just not it's just not doing real well. And we have to scrape the image this way, and then we get a great pickup. And I just want the one leaf right there, so I need to take off the others with some tape. Okay, so I can position that little leaf right there. Okay, so that turned out really good. I think I would like some, like another one right here. So let's try that. And I think we can just get something around the edge here. And I'm just going to remove some of those other ones. Okay, and then we'll just position it right here. There. I like that. Um, just so you know, the stamper that I um, that I switched to is my Bundle Monster Monocle Stamper, which is one that I love and that I, I used all the time. Um, it's just like really, really huge though. And so um, I bought the, the um, Moe London 3-in-1 Stamper just because it's a little smaller. But I do love, you know, I love the, the short handles on these so you can see better you're not looking down through you know like a cone it, it makes it much much easier to see where you're stamping and i just put some liquid latex on so um, i'll wait till that dries and then i'll come back is that i don't want green fingers <laughs> okay so now i'm gonna do my other nails okay scrape pick it up we got a good pickup and I'm just going to stamp it right on there perfect okay and we just have one more to do And that is my thumb. There. All right, now I'm just going to clean up my nails and we'll come back for the finished look. Well, I'm going to add top coat too. <laughs> Somehow I didn't record the end of the video, but here's the finished look. I hope you liked it. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not one of my subscribers, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.